Hey, it's Reese, and there's been lots of questions going around the internet about this new Alula material that's being used on the airframes of some new super lightweight kiteboarding kites. And so I'm here at the Ocean Rodeo headquarters um, where Alula is being tested, and I am going to be doing some load testing on some Alula that I have here, and I'm going to compare it to some standard Dacron that is normally used on the leading edge of kites. Alright, so the Alula weighed in at 78 GSM and the Dimension Poly and Dacron weighed in at 157 GSM. And so when we go into this tear test, which is going to happen next, keep in mind that the Alula is actually basically half the weight of the Dacron. Alright, so I've got uh, some little square samples of material here that I've cut out from these sheets, bigger sheets, and they are about 11 centimeters by 9 centimeters. So we're going to start with the Dacron. I'm going to melt a couple holes through it and then we're going to put it on the machine and see how much it can hold uh, when I pull on it like this. Four hundred and sixty five pounds. <laughs> we are going to try and do a tear propagation test. So I've put a slit in the material already to kind of simulate if the material was to get sliced by a rock or by a, a prickle bush or something sharp. And now we're going to pull on it in a similar way that we did before and see what happens and how strong it is when it already has a slit inside of it. Eighty eight pounds. We've got the same slit cut in the middle of this thing, so we're going to do another tear propagation test on this. Hundred and eighty seven pounds. <laughs> 